Hello everybody, this is size 10 Pablo Sook and the thread I'm using is block. I'll explain the materials as I go along. So if you just start below the eye <coughs> and just go back. This is a two-tone Dial Bach. So I'm going to put the beard first as usually I showed you uh, in my previous video how to add a simple beard because this is the only way I find it's easy the beard I'm using is a cock huckle black, dyed black so just take the pinch and just about length you need uh, a body length or a little bit longer is entirely up to you so if you touch them underneath and and secure them unwind your thread so here I will keep going like this hide everything if you have a longer fiber you can cut them if they are longer than a shank <coughs> Keep going and here I'm going to add the tail with the same cock huckle so if you can find nice and stiff one sorry that's not the one just take your time I haven't got longer fiber left so this is a Chinese cock, so they are a little bit different, difficult to touch them. Again, just about the length you want, a body length or even their ribs will be longer, doesn't matter. <coughs> then I'm going to come back here towards the tail and I'm going to use the organza ribbon this is a black one and I'm going to use two colors so I'm going to as you can see I cut this like about two to three millimeter wide and just cut this a little bit here just to create a catching point and then catch it here in make sure you take your time that's it and hide all this keep coming up towards the body don't worry about the tail I'll fix this tail after and then I'm just going to level up this middle bit <coughs> now what I'll do bring this by using touching turn or you can leave a gap if it's up to you keep coming up just past the middle and then cash this here secure this properly and I'm going to cut this off and make sure it's scaled properly and level the body again very simple to tie this kind of pattern like works really well just in this season now coming up towards the like a summer now I'm using a red bright red organza so cut it again like usually the one I did with the black one and just a little point here so you can catch it easily catch that one very close and here use touch and turn hide everything
I mean, just to try to get body level, but once this our guns is gonna go around the shank, it will cover everything. So just to, like I said, take your time again. I'm gonna come back because just to need a little bit level in the middle. So we can have a nice smooth body. Nice use stretch and turn, keep coming up all the way. There's a one more turn, and I'm going to catch this here. And don't worry about this little beard going all over we can fix this after <coughs> cut this very close now here unwind your thread I'm going to put a little bit box on the thread just to secure this properly and then bring this beard and kind of form a decent size of head because heads are essential in any part when you do. So when you put beard like this, it's much easier, and you find it, you know, it's not difficult to put beard. I'm gonna unwind this because some feathers are not really. Take your time now. Try to just trying to get them downwards uh, and take your time. And form the head and finish it off. That should be okay. Now I'm going to get the lighter in. So there you have a uh, two tone, I like to say BBO Dialba, Dialba, because it's a hot spot and it really works very well in the reservoirs. If you're fishing for, you know, rainbow trout, and just use your nail varnish to seal the head I need to give a couple of cords so I need a nice and shiny head so I'm gonna show you once it's this one dry after a few cords so there you have it uh, another one of my favorite pattern two-tone organza dialba great pattern for all year round I hope you enjoy this video Thanks for watching.